Welcome to another tutorial from GetWebInspiration.com. In this tutorial, I will show you the basics that you need to know in order to make your own Web 2.0 contract form. In the next part, I will learn you how to style it in HTML and CSS. First, I'll make a new file, set the width and the height to 400 and resolution to 72. Uh, I will make the input fields first. I will go for the rounded rectangle tool and make a selection this should be good I'll right click and press blending options I'll go to color overlay and pick the white color I'll also add an inner shadow I'll put it to distance 0, size 3, and I'll go to normal blending mode, and I'll pick something a bit more light gray. Press OK and see the results. I wanted to keep it pretty minimalistic, I don't want to add too much to it. I'll name it to input field 1 and right click it, duplicate layer and name it to field 2 I'll use shift and arrow down to put it down a bit then I'll duplicate it again and name it to field 3 uh, this is our input fields and now we just need to add the text area I'll zoom in just a little bit it's easy to see and there we go here's our text area I'll right click one of the input fields and press copy lay style and I right click the text field and press paste layer style. I'm gonna rename it this to text area and zoom out a little bit. Okay, now we just need a little button. So I'll go with the same tool, around the rectangle tool, and stick to five pixels in radius make it just a little bit bigger on the height there we go and zoom out right click blending options gradient overlay and I'm gonna pick some nice green color I think if I can find one I think I'm gonna sheet a little bit and take this one and for another one I'll go with this one and I'll copy this value and press OK and I'll go with a stroke should be one pixel and the color I'll take the one I just copied and go to brightness and lower it a little bit so it's a bit darker press OK OK there we go we have our button now we just need to name it button and add some text to it uh, gonna take continue and change the color to white and place it on the bottom I think it should be a little bit bigger maybe not that big like 22 points and 
to this I'm gonna take blending option and pick uh, our drop shadow I'll put it to one pixel and one pixel I said and this could be either one or two depending on what effect you want looks pretty much the same uh, here once again I will paste the value we took earlier and make it a bit darker maybe not too much there we go and I think I'm gonna take bold for this one yes now we'll just add some labels for the input fields uh, your name take it to 14 points and change the color to not too dark something like this maybe change it to regular maybe just a little bit brighter yes duplicate the layer hold shift and mouse down and I will have an uh, email we'll duplicate get uh, and I will put the subject There we go, we have our form. So in the next part I will show you how to do this and style it in HTML and CSS. So ready, go. Until then, have a good time.